A movie at the Heartland Film Festival is putting up some staggering ticket sales, and it's actually igniting a push for change. The film centers around the opioid crisis in Brown County. Fox 59's Mike Sullivan was there this evening for the world premiere at Newfield. He shows us what producers are hoping to accomplish with this movie. It is a film birthed from conversation meant to start conversation. In fact, the producers first saw a social media post in Carmel and realized those issues were also happening in Brown County. Our screening is about to begin. If a film can be powerful to watch, then its message. This is worse than going to Iraq can be that much greater. It's a war in Brown County. The opioid crisis is casting a shadow over their fall foliage, like a secret hidden in those hills. We have to increase emotional awareness for healing to uh, happen. Lisa Hall owns Glory Girl Productions. The filmmaker had just seen a post from a family in Carmel. They had just come back from their third funeral in a matter of like two, three weeks of young men who had overdosed fatally. Fellow producer Amy Pozak read the same words. She called me and she said, what is the climate of substance use disorder in Brown County? I said, it's pandemic. Thus, a film was born. It's called The Addict's Wake, a look at Brown County's opioid crisis this is this or death. through the eyes of Hoosiers in the thick of it. I lost part of my soul when I realized I was an addict. Say, so what can our family do? Who, where can we plug in in our community? Is there, you know, an hour a week I could give someone? That's the hope that their film sparks local change. It's currently sold more tickets than any other film at the Heartland Film Festival. This is outselling actually Will Smith. This is outselling Kristen Stewart right now. Jessica Chapman is the director of marketing with Heartland. I think people will have a better understanding of what's happening. It's even drawn members of the governor's office. Doug Hunsinger, executive director of drug prevention, treatment, and enforcement. This is this is every day for me. Uh, so these these are stories of um, everyday Hoosiers coming together. Tonight, he gave the state's distinguished Hoosier Award to a family featured in the film. It's really important that we tell the stories in ways that um, that help break down the stigma. Perhaps this film. Addiction's about killing. It's about beating. Is a first step. If you missed tonight's debut, you can still watch it from the comfort of your own home. It is streaming virtually at heartlandfilm.org. At Newfields, I'm Mike Sullivan, Fox 59 News.